Well, good afternoon to you. Things had been building up very nicely over the last couple of days in the lead-up to this game, but as you can see, the last couple of hours are a rather different story. The weather has decided not to play ball. The conditions here are a long way from ideal. It is teeming with rain, and that has left both teams contemplating very different challenges. It's almost old-style. Understandable looks of concern on the faces of managers, officials, players and fans alike. Blue and burgundy wherever you look, hymns ringing loud and proud. This is what it is to be in the Camp Nou. A mouth-watering game, this, between two very high-quality sides. A treat for everybody here. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and, hopefully, the style of contest. Got things on the way. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Leonardo Bonucci. He's as imposing as they come, Peter. And he knows just how to use his, his physical attributes to make life difficult for attackers. He's also got a very good eye for a killer long ball. So don't be surprised if you see him launch a few counter attacks for his team today. Yeah, the scourge of so many strikers. The lift, and it's played forward. Cristiano Ronaldo. And he's there to cut it out. Hoists it forward, and it's got through. Now it's Griezmann going through. Danilo goes looking. Chiesa. Well, each team knows that they're still well below standard, and it's a question of uh, which can uh, find a way out. Lovely feet. Well played, he saw that coming. Chiesa, Danilo. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Plenty waiting in the middle. Danilo goes for the cross. And here's Rapp, he's had a go! Rabio really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Juventus, very keen on the aerial route. Look, if you're good at it and instructed to carry on doing it, then you find a way of making it work, and they are. The freeze had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Reflections on the first half. Well, this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers. Nothing has been created for them. I think the service has been extremely poor. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. The 
Here we go again. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. That's surely a foul free kick. And he is going into that little black book. to make a great save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. <laughs> there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. In it comes. And the shot! Dybala plays it short. So it's going to be another corner. They've played it short. Rabio puts it into the mid. Great leap! Dybala has a goal! Bernadeschi. No, that's not the ball he wanted. De Ligt. Rabio. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, the ball's come loose. Good take, and he's had a look. And the follow-up. Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Barcelona can make their change now with uh, a break in play. And it's hoisted clear. He's left his man. A really good feat from him. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. A heavy challenge. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Quadrado tries to get it forward quickly. He's got options out wide. He's had that put on the plate. Messi! It's anyone's ball. Now, can he capitalise? And it's Jordi Alba. It's found its way to him. A oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. They seem to have lost their sense of direction. Uh, it should be higher up the pitch. That's it. They're going to get 30 minutes more. Well, nil-nil doesn't offer a fair reflection of what we've seen. The game's been vibrant. I think the atmosphere has remained buoyant, and we just need the scoreline to, to step into line. Uh, fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. minutes gone and nothing between them still it's gone for a throw in and 
here's Messi. Loose ball, who's going to get there? And now they can launch a counter. And that's been won straight back. Bentancur, Cristiano Ronaldo, Alexandro tries lifting it over. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. Promising move that. Good inroads into it. Half time, extra time. And it is starting to feel as though there is an inevitability about penalties here. I like to think that both teams still want to win it in the final 15 minutes. The question is, can the players go that far? And we're off for the final time. So, for the last time, who dares to win? Bentancur. And it's Messi. Alexandro battles to win it back. Gets it back. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Rabio. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Good challenge, he just stood firm. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late... Hits one! Well, both sides... And that's it, nothing to separate them. It is penalties. Yeah, the longer it went on, it kind of became inevitable that it would end this way. And, and while each defence can be proud, they've got very little say from here. It's up to the keepers now. So after two long hours, it comes down to nerve, to technique under pressure, to penalties. Boy, you can feel the tension. So he walks up to the spot and puts the ball down. So the first penalty. Oh, he saved it! Well, that's great concentration from the keeper and a wonderful save. Ronaldo next in line, and here he is. And he's found the corner. Looks like he's done it a thousand times, never looked like missing. Barcelona in search of parity. No, oh, it's been saved! He's so focused there, fantastic save. Juventus looking to extend their advantage. And he's put them two in front. Barcelona can't afford to miss another one. Oh, he cannot score. Ter Stegen obliged to stop this to keep them alive. Oh, brilliant 
Shots, he had to save it, and he did. That's a lovely stop from the keeper. He's done his teammates proud with that one. Barcelona must score to keep their hopes alive. No! Saved it! And their fate is sealed! So, in the end, heartbreak. A few of them inconsolable. But this is what footballing fate had stored up for them. It is nasty. Oh, this is so tough on the penalty taker as the heroes celebrate. Right now, it's a horrible experience but they really should try and get those chins up. Well, thanks for your company, Jim, and a very good day to you.